Hello, and welcome to Equilibrium. I think you're finishing my silent sleep. Well, let's check out the briefing. Some days you just feel lucky. A local fence told me some homeless guy stumbled on something very interesting. From the sound of it, the bum found an entrance to a keeper facility. Standard practice for the keepers would be to seal up the place after that, but I'm hoping I might find a way in. I'd love a couple of hours inside to catch up on old times, and maybe find out why the hell they're so interested in me these days. Short, sweet, simple. The view of the level, I really don't know what to expect. Well, let's try experts, shall we? They just keep us. They're not going to be that hostile, right? We just, we just, they keep the balance. As long as we, you know, don't lean too far to one side or the other, they won't bother us, right? Right, so it's in the sewers, huh? No shop. So what do I start with? Broadheads, that's it. Not even a rope arrow. And two flares, okay. I guess I'm not going to be doing much uh, climbing or torch extinguishing, I, I suppose. Oh. What the? Something's not right here. I think I deserve a pat on the back for that one. <laughs> you do indeed, Gap. Well done. You walked right into the trap. Gap. Though you may have been inadvertently useful in the past, we have decided to end our association. Today, you will die. Five of our most able acolytes await you in this compound. The doors have been magically sealed, so escape is impossible. We do not take this action lightly, but I believe it is the only way balance can be restored. Well, <clears throat> the trap, escape with your life. Leaving each of your assailants alive, but minus his keeper pendant, should show them ha just how far below you they are. Steal a pendant off the waist of each keeper, but don't kill anyone. Interesting. But they do have a map, of course they don't have a map. Oh, so they let me in. Of course, because they want to kill me. So, I guess... I need to be on the lookout for uh, trouble. For lots of trouble. I wonder what's downstream. I don't want to try jumping in just yet because it makes noise. Set up there. I was staying last window. Oh, they are quiet and cloaked. So I guess. If they can't see me, then I can't see them. It's a little too suspicious, isn't it? Well, what's the worst that could happen? There is a trap, it drops me into something. 
Nah. Garrett, you have been tricked. We, the Keepers, do not want you dead. However, this situation has been engineered by an aggressive group of former students. We cannot assist you directly, but our knowledge is yours. The other exit to this compound is magically sealed, but there is a way to break the spell. In this facility, there are four elemental glyph chambers and many books detailing their use. Learn of them and then escape. Your foes have some ability. Take care. Wait, do I want lights on? I don't think I want lights on. All right. So some of them want me dead and some of them don't. Is it just a student prank? Why would students know or care about me? That doesn't add up. Oh, that's the way into the water if I want to explore the water. Still pin it off the ways to be to keep it as fine, right? It's just a weird running, stopping and starting. Very strange. But thank you for alerting to me to the, to the tile floor, Mr. Keeper. That's very nice. So, do I wait for him to come back? Yeah, follow him up there. Hmm. Well, this tile floor is can be a nuisance. Hello, we've got doors down there. I heard footsteps. Should I be knocking them out or should I just be avoiding them? Definitely creep. I feel like if they run into me though, it will be... They will actually see me. Oh. Hmm. Oh, he's just chilling on me. I don't understand why the sudden running. But okay. Fortunately, he wasn't close enough for me to safely move forward and pick his pocket because, well, the whole, uh, Oh well, this is a whole tile floor problem, but he comes back this way. I don't know if he's going to cut the corner again, otherwise I'd, I'd move closer to the corner so I could see. But, uh... If he cuts the corner, that could just mean him walking into me. Oh. I thought he'd just come upstairs, but from the sound of it, he's not. Hmm. Well. Let's wait and see what he does. Exciting watching, I know. I 
constant change of floor and uh, starting and stopping makes it very hard to track them by sound as well. Come on. Just keep her come back this way. Okay. I think he's coming. Right, got his pendant. All right, so he hangs out in this library. Didn't even my compass, that's really annoying. Okay. Things going back that way. All right. What? Why could I only take one of these and does it make a difference? Don't understand. I guess that's what I'm going to need to uh, read. Read books. Well, there's lots of books there, but I don't see any that look readable. Big waterfall. Oh, there's a just someone walking up the other end. Pretty sure it's all movement. Yeah, oh, it's a secret door. Okay. There was movement. We're coming or going. But who and where? Blends in pretty well for a for a door. Oh shit, he's coming this way. Dependence. Right, well, let's take this as our moment. Good. I still. Definitely stepped on the tile there. It's not. I can't see them at all. Oh, they didn't actually come out. They walked up to the door and opened up, didn't. It's 
go to the dark. I think they came down here. I think I heard this door. trouble trying to figure out what these guys are doing because they're not moving regularly and that's extremely disruptive to my patterns of uh, of, of learning ah! well that's not good he must have been searching Died dramatically. Oh, I forgot we're not supposed to kill him. All right, well that's going to be a problem. Maybe I need to knock him out. I think, under the circumstances, knocking them out is going to be the best bet because... Have I picked this pocket already? Yeah, I've got two pendants. They're not stacking for some reason. Does that mean he's already alerted to me and he's going to just see me as when he comes back up here? I don't know. Oh, he's just going in the door. He'll be coming through this door in a minute. Okay, he went up the upper door on the far side. I wonder if he heard me and got alerted and that's and started searching when he when I did that one step on tile. I don't know how you how tunes out. It just turns around at random. Oh, I think he's looking right at me. You know, I have the same skills of invisibility. Nope. So what am I supposed to do if I can tell them to kill them? They see me, I'm gonna just run and hide. This... Oh. I can't just run and hide, but that's not gonna be very good. I don't know where this is going to take me. Does this just run in an infinite circle around the entire facility? This is where I came in, wasn't it? Wondering where the current went. Well, I guess I'll find out. It's more exciting than sitting in the dark waiting to knock someone on the head and then they uh, turn around and see me. Oh, there's someone up there. I can't get out as I've watched this, so this is a problem. It's brightly lit. Alright, uh, oh, there's a tunnel here. Hang on. 
is a second one of these things. Well, it doesn't help me get out. It just helps me come here. I might just have to reload because I don't know how to just uh, actually make it out of this bloody water. That's one of the four elemental locks, and you know, common sense might suggest that's the water lock. Wait, this opened? Poor Carlos was, open, was closed before. What? There's still a dead end. That doesn't... Doesn't help at all. Doesn't really change a thing. And also, I noticed... Like here, there's, there's no room brush. It's gone quiet. Feels like I shouldn't be here. I wonder if the portcullis just disappeared by accident or something. I'm going to reload. So this fella comes through here. Maybe we can knock him out as he does so. Oh, I do feel more hidden right here. All right, let's knock him out. He's coming back up. Keep the door open so I can hear his footsteps. Just stay poised. He's standing still in the hallway. Probably doing a searching animation. He's gone back out the upper door. No, he spotted me. What the hell, man? What the hell? I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't really understand how the designer expects this to be played. I mean, I guess I could run away, you know, but again, I go full in the water and I can't get out, so that's a serious problem. Maybe if there's a rope arrow, it would be something I could attach to. Can't remember if it was a bridge over the water, was wooden or not, where the wisp was. So that means putting her open first. Okay, where did he stop? It's like right there somewhere. The thing is I can't see where he is or which way he's facing. Ah! Nope. Ah! What the hell? Let him be magically annoying. I've got a dependent. Guess I don't need to bother him. He doesn't bother me. I guess he comes out there. There must be another door up this end, right? Yeah. Right, there's wood up the top, wooden beams, but there is a cap on top of them. I think there's somebody walking in one of these bookshops.
I got them out, actually? Nope. Let's not try. Okay, so I don't even know why I've got the blackjack, but maybe on other difficulties it would be possible to knock them out. So I guess we just need to play slow and evade. There's lots of darkness, and if I... Will you be patient? Can't see if he's in the room, whether he would see me if I move into this light. I'm even wondering whether I should uh, whether I should keep playing this mission or upload it or whatever because okay so there's another one I could get downstairs if I wanted to. Window. What am I supposed to do about these talismans though? Don't make any sense to me. I can pick up any of the four and I can put it on the pedestal and they all just vanish and get another get another choice. So it must be Obviously, you didn't get to keep the book with the instructions, but it didn't mention anything about having to do them in any particular order that I can recall. I want to get down safely. Do I want to get down safely, given that that just takes me back where I was before? I think. Yeah, that's where I came in. Right, I saw, I saw this guy running up there as I, as I entered. But I didn't really uh, connect it with him. There were five, I think it said, right? I've got three other pendants so far. So now we've got one guy up ahead, somewhere. All right, I haven't seen anyone else in this room. Yeah, which way did I go? I went that way, I think. I think that's not the same, I'm not 100% sure. Feels like I'm gonna want hard saves to fall back onto. All right, so here's the whisper room, which is awful. Not like wisps wandering around and lighting me up. Oh, there's a ladder. That's how I get out of the water, okay. Makes it easy for me to see them, but it also makes them easier for them to see me, so I think not.
All right. It's the upper level of this room. And that leads, not sure where. Pendants. Okay. I almost walked right into him. I could go back and try to follow him. Again, I don't know if he's just stopped, because when he's in this much darkness, he's actually completely invisible, and I could just bump into him, and then he would cut me to death. But if I wait patiently until he moves, I'll hear him. Lucky for me, these keepers seem to have worse hearing than Garrett does. Wait for this guy to come back. What do I see where this goes? Oh, there's a library. No, it's... right. That's just the other side of that room. Been here. I mean, there are stairs here. Want to get downstairs here? I don't think I do. Oh, my friend's coming back. No, he's stopping and hiding. Hoping to catch me unawares, I bet. I think I'm going back that way because I'm thinking that it's probable that in that big library room with the wisp is the is a fifth guy. Maybe not, I don't know for sure. Where is he, where's he going? Ah. Uh, well if he's going that way, let me go this way. Right, this is the exit, I guess. Aho! Uh -huh. Okay, we need blue N. What N? So this is how I know what I need. The air, right? The air. Q. Pull the Q. It's not really a Q. The Earth. Kind of that shape. And the fire flame. All right. So now I think I know. I just need the four talismans. Where did it as a friend go coming or going? Don't know. Well
here is the whisper room. I don't see any sign of anybody. I'm be quiet. Even if I have to go into the light for a minute. Okay. Don't do that to me. A new room. I'm trying to see if the person making that footstep sounds is up here or down below. I think we're down below. They could easily be coming upstairs though. Oh, look at all this light, isn't that good? Alright, well, let's have a look. See what we can see. Ah, oh, they are going up and down the stairs. Circles, fast fighting problems. Come on, dude, you can make it. Might need to uh, quick save, quick load to try and free him from his fast fighting problems. He seems to have sorted it out. But he is one I have not seen before. So he has the fifth. I may not need to go downstairs, but I certainly need to rob him. He's at the top of the stairs now. I'm going to need to chill by the top of the stairs, I think. I hope he doesn't come around this way, otherwise we're screwed. If he goes back downstairs, I can set up near the top and wait for him to come up again. And pick his pocket. At least that's the plan. Oh, we just go around the top. God. So he definitely went around to the left. Don't know if he ever comes around here. I also don't know if there's any reason for me to go down there.
I think he's coming. The randomness of their movement is frustrating. So I don't know if he's going to be turning towards me when he comes up the stairs or away from me. I hope away from me. Never seen him turn down this way, but I can't guarantee anything. So where are they at the moment? Well, they exist. I hear their footsteps. You guys need to fix your roof. It's a pretty significant leak. Oh, there it is. Just at the foot of the stairs. See, I feel like the concept here isn't bad, but the execution of this mission just doesn't really work because, like, I'd love to go in, be a little more aggressive in pickpocketing these guys, but I can't because, firstly, I can't see what they're doing. I don't know which way they're facing. They seem to have really good hearing, uh, which isn't a problem in this room, admittedly, but unless I'm funky on stairs but once they see me uh, I don't have any options except just to run away and hope they calm down and that makes them harder to pickpocket from because then they're uh, more alerted ever, ever after um, the biggest one is the light there's, there's, there's light and shadow there's plenty of dark places which is necessary but if I can't see what they're doing, and if they're not at all regular about what they're doing, both together means I just, you know, I could save scum wildly and do it, right? But I'm try I don't want to be save scumming. I don't play save scumming generally in these recordings. So I said I'm having to just watch them wait and wait till they come back up the stairs here. They just keep, seem to actually just seem to be kind of running back and forth between the same spots, which is also weird. So they certainly came up the stairs a few times before. So because I can't see what they're doing, I can't like move when the back is turned. And because they then don't move regularly, um, I can't just go by sound to figure out where they're standing where and go. And because of all the random variation in the paths, like if, I mean, I can try, right? I can try. Dark enough on these stairs, I shouldn't get seen if I'm not moving. Right, let's assume he's facing left. Nope. He saw me. And I couldn't see him at all. He was like literally totally visible there. Okay, so I think he is doing a look around animation while he's standing in front of the pillar. Which is probably why he saw me. But again. I couldn't tell that. Right, I 
I can just vaguely see him now. He is facing, looking upstairs. Or maybe he's looking right at me. It's uh, very hard to tell. He's just a really kind of outline. You probably can't even see him on the stream unless I actually move. So the outline moves relative to the background. Now he's just standing there. Well, dude, move. I need to get around. Right, it's down there. Let's get out of here. Alright, I'm gonna make a another save here. Okay, so we have the five pendants, which is unfortunately not set to stack. We have the Earth Talisman. We need the other talismans now. I don't know where I'm going to find them. I mean, I think I found them all before, but I don't remember where they are. It's this place I don't really understand. It's the layout of this place. What I want to do... I could go up to the other end of this room. Let's see where this goes. What's the worst that could happen? Someone will see us and... Cuts to ribbons. That goes nowhere. Alright, thank you. Step up. Okay, so let's get back. Wait, this is, this is, we're right near the water talisman, right? It's right down here. So I guess we might as well get it while we're, while we're near it. Which one is it that I wanted? Blue pen shape. That one. Right. Now I guess we go back to the central hall. There is a guy up in that upper area, but I don't think it matters. Is there a reason to go this way? Let's go upstairs, I'm hearing. I don't know, I'm just going to check, because my memory... I don't remember whether we found one of the talismans really early on in the mission. I can't remember if it was back here or not. No, it wasn't. I think that's just where we started the mission. So let's go to the right. Out of here. So, okay, there's a guy that comes up and down the stairs here. 
And I haven't been to that far door. I don't have to beat any of these doors. Great class. It does come down here, but I don't know exactly where. Oh, some water arrows, that's useful. Your perception of events is flawed. The acolyte is not a tool to be wielded, nor a random fact that temporarily restoring balance through mere coincidence. In the most basic sense, he is balance. Your misinterpretation is unexpected and as such inconsequential. Your attempt will fail and your survival depends on the acolyte's forbearance. To embrace a cause is to lose one's balance. Remember these words. That's actually... Close that door. Read right in here while we can read this one. Again, they refuse to accept any other interpretation except their own. I have taken more drastic action. I have some supporters and we have banded together in an attempt to finally restore balance. Five may be a small number, but he is just one. One of our smaller facilities was sealed recently when its discovery became a possibility. I think we will make our stand there. If I make its existence known to a few locals, the acolyte is sure to become aware of it also. Posing as a nameless drifter, I told the local fence of my find. I have no doubt the acolyte will soon be informed, and will find this place irresistible. So this whole thing was a setup, was it? Let's see, let's hope our friend is not down on this floor. I kind of want to know where they're going to go. Let's be quick. The glyph chambers are still a mystery to us. When the keepers left this place, they were shut down, and there doesn't seem to be any way to restore them. I should continue to research this later. The acolytes seem to arrive, and I feel as confident in my skills as I ever have. We should be rid of him easily. I saw them there for a second. Yeah, they're right there. Then I think he runs back upstairs. What he did before. No. Nope. Oh, yes. Okay, so he stands in front of that door. I just need to be very careful here. Especially the speed that he moves up and down, and sometimes he moves further away after going upstairs, and sometimes he comes straight back down.
That's bad. He's very aware of it now. So now I guess he's not even looking at him, just listening to him. He was already searching at that point. So I felt I had to use the distraction. Okay. He stopped searching. Amazing they don't have these doors open. So I need to go back up there. Where he's gone, so I need to be careful. Alright, I don't think he'll come and stand on this corner. So I have a moment's safety, maybe. Unless he was facing this direction just then. He is a nuisance, he's a problem. I need him to go back down there so I can get by, that's all I need. I think he did see me as I went past the light and came to investigate, so I had to distract him again. I have some water arrows now, so at least I can put out one of those glass lamps. Alright, he stopped searching, but he's still probably at heightened awareness. He's still definitely moving about randomly. So watch and wait, and watch and wait. Okay, actually he's maybe gone far enough. For my gun. I think he might have seen me then. Can't tell. Alright, for the fire I want just the ordinary flame one. Okay. Three talismans. Oh shit. Ah. Yeah, this isn't gonna work very well. Come on, just kill me already. Ah. I no idea where he was, but he was maybe right by this door looking in. It completely visible, so I walked into him. Is this after I got the talisman or not? Yes. I just need to sit here, be patient, listen. Wait till he moves away. Oh, there he is. He's going around the corner. Probably wasn't visible on the stream, but... Alright, we have some water arrows, might as well use them. Let's 
so there's a guy who walks up and down here from the secret door now I can't remember if they're oh, there they are I can't remember where the next room was I think it was through that door it might have been in the secret passages or maybe downstairs, the air talisman room. In fact, I'm not even 100% sure if I've seen the air talisman room. Could try a water arrow at that gas lamp from here, but I think it's a little too far away. And did they close the door because they came in? So went in? Yes, they went downstairs. Just heard them open the other door. They also come out that door. Above the start. I don't think this is the way to the gas talisman chamber. I'm not sure. I have to wait till this guy moves. So I know what he's doing. I think it's just saw him up the far end there. Yes, he's right. Right there looking around. He's looking this way. And he's coming for a run. Come on, mate. Just head down the corridor. Okay, good. Air talisman we need, the one that looks kind of like a Q. Shit, he saw us. <laughs> you hear him pull his bow? That's okay. It's okay. I'm trying to get a shortcut to here, but this is not actually useful. So I need to get back up there, and actually I probably could have done that from where I was. Now he's going to come running somewhere to try and find where he saw me, where I went to. Probably. However, I've got the four talismans I need. I know I can get where I need to be from the whisper room, right? Just head through the doors to the left here.
Hmm. I heard someone. I heard some footsteps that were not mine. I think I got away with it. Let's put these things in. Strange buff of magic smoke. That one didn't magic smoke, that's weird. Are they popping because I'm right or because I'm wrong? What? What? I brought you the talismans. What do you what more do you want? Well, I'm going to go look this up because this makes no sense to me. I don't know. I have no idea what they want and there's nothing to tell me what they want. And lots of trial and error while hiding from these guys have already alerted is not really what I'm here for. Not when there's no hints to go on. Unless it wants me to bring them all the talismans. But no, I haven't had anything happen. Uh, Alright, so, so I will be back. Okay, so I looked it up and apparently I'm supposed to be reading some books somewhere to figure out which of the talismans I actually need. Only I haven't found any books anywhere. And now I've got these invisible assassins all alerted. It's right there. Okay, he's war he's going back the way. So let's I guess go to an area where there's books. Let's go take a look downstairs here. I hope we don't get spotted. We will get spotted because it's so fucking bright. Did he seem easy running down here? I can't tell. Oh, there's a book. Okay, the book of all air forms wind, fog, gas, air. And uh, because of local spoilers, what we need is uh, the one on that we saw at the exit was gas, the one we need is actually air. So I wouldn't have known to look for that book. Because everything looked like blank bookshelves. So for air, we need uh, bull horns one. You know what it looks like? The bull's, the bull's head. I can't tell if that guy's riled up or not. I'm gonna guess not. I hope. I should have kept one of my water arrows for this. Because this one's constraining my movement far more. You know what? If I 
I just get back through here? No, let's just go this way. Let's just take a risk because I don't know where they are and I can't see them. And if you did see me, he'll have lost sight of me now. For a moment. Okay, so I guess I need to go downstairs here and try and find... Oh, who's this I'm hearing? Oh, it's this guy. Okay. Walks up to that door. Sometimes. Where is he? I don't know where he is, but he's not here right now. He'll probably see me if he... If he looks, well... That's where I need to go for the talisman, but that's not where the... Hello, I see you. Oh, the secret door man. He's not going in the door, he's just standing there. Because the door didn't open. The word for means I can't hear anything. Thought I just heard the door open, so I made a run for it. Spark becomes flame. Ash becomes spark. Flame becomes smoke. Smoke becomes ash. Which one's which? Uh, so we had flame. Flame becomes smoke. I don't know which one smoke is, but uh, I need to get back upstairs. Here is footsteps, I have no idea whether he's searching or... Okay, he's just going indoors. Or not. Yeah, I think he closed it behind him. Don't know if that means he's coming out this way or not. Or whether he's going out the other side. It does mean he's in the tunnels. Makes it a bad time. Here he is. Oh, fuck. Well, apparently he came because he saw me or something. I don't know. This mission...
Everyone in the comments saying, oh, this mission is so scary, and I'm saying, no, it's not scary, it's incredibly just tedious and frustrating. Alright, maybe I should just run everywhere. I mean, I mean they've, got, they've got bows and arrows, that's a problem. Alright, running everywhere. If they only had swords, they could just, you know, Benny Hill this. They have arrows. Okay, there's the book I need for this, for the water one. And almost invisible ladders. Um, I mean, they are so invisible, someone in the forums was also asking. Saying we were trapped in the water and couldn't get out. Water! So we had that one and we need cloud, okay. I guess I can go get right now. <clears throat> the other thing, the other actual useful thing I got from the farms, which well, maybe useful. So we don't worry about this light. So we need you. Um, it's the suggestion of using flares, throwing a flare to light up the area where a, um, whoops, one of, where one of the guys is, <laughs> which is not a bad suggestion. Okay, so let's go the opposite way. Find out what we need for Earth. Back where the guy runs up and down the stairs. You know, the actual place, I, the only place that actually went downstairs. Oh, wait, we're here first. The wrong one. I'm getting confused. I don't want to go that way yet. I need to go up here and through some of the oh, some of the doors at the top. That's right. Don't think anyone comes in this room. Better safe than sorry. Okay, so I don't know where this guy is. I also don't know where I'm going when I'm looking for the book. Up here, we sit down below still. I haven't the foggy said yet. I can hear some footsteps, but it's not helping me. I guess I'm going to go for it and just find out. So if I still need to get a sword to the face, then I know I guessed wrong. Okay, so where is this book that I need here? Okay, 
can't see a gap in the bookshelves. Oh, there he is. So he's just standing around there, looking around, not moving anymore, which I think maybe means he's bugged. However, I can't see the book I need. Oh, I see. Animal becomes earth. Earth becomes seed. Seed becomes tree. Tree becomes animal. So for earth, I had the one that looked like... Seed, maybe? A tree? Let's see, read it. Um, earth to seed to tree to animal. Alright. Well, as long as he's happy to just stay down there. I can get in and out of this room without him harassing me. Now, where was the Earth Talisman? Put it down this way. Yes, here it is. Okay, so we have earth becomes seed becomes a tree and that is that one animal that's like a paw print so that's the one we had that's, i guess it's a seed so we take the tree i guess all right so this gives us this water and earth that we've got right now right yeah Okay, so going that way, switch draws on those sides gets me back to the ending, but I don't need to get to the ending. I need to get back to kind of where we started, so we can go back out of this room, back down the stairs. Wait, 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 the first room I need to go to. It's the library one, right? And there's a guy that wanders around up here. I need to go around to those to that area. Where is this guy and what's he doing?
So this room has three people coming and going from it, I think. It makes it terribly highly traffic. Just one guy comes out that door. And there's one guy who wanders around in these stacks. Let me try the uh, player trick. I, mean, I guess it makes him easy to see. But did he alert to the flare or not? Just walked into him. Wait. <clears throat> wait, 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 wait. Wasn't there another talisman door up here? I guess not. Where'd he go? Who's at the far end? Okay, so this is the air ones when you... Did he just come in here? Oh no, that's just me moving forward. It's Bullhorn's ones, okay. He saw something. He's suspicious now. Well... Not quite what I meant to do. Now he's standing right up there looking out this way. Oh hey, if he sees me down here, he's got a long way to come. Yeah, he saw me. I don't remember where I need to go. There he is. Need the fire talisman now. Which I think was near the exit. Maybe. Maybe this way. Way to Earth. Did I 
it's just wait a So I almost walked into him. I'm missing something. Where's where's the place I'm missing? I kind of wonder if it's possible to get on these roof beams. Why does this love push that don't make sense to me right now? You need to be at the far end of this room. She's just standing in the corner. Oh, he's just standing in the corner. Yes, he's right ahead of me. Straight ahead of me. fucking walked into me. No, this is not where I need to be. It's not where the fire talisman is at all. Damn it. Alright. Where? Go this way, we've got the guy that goes down the stairs, and that leads straight into the library room, which is just where we were. Maybe. Wait, I'm, I'm so confused. Let's go this way. Let's be thorough.
You didn't see me, but you almost walked into me. I don't know which way he's facing, I might throw a flare so I could see him better. But he's right in front of me. Oh wait, that's the other half of the library room. Alright, here it comes again. Okay, so that's the talisman room right there, that's right. He came downstairs. That's my signal to move. Is this is the fire room. This is the fire room. Okay, we need smoke, was it? Smoke. Flame. Uh, spark. Smoke. What was it? An ash. I don't know which one this is. I don't know if this is the right one. But honestly, going back. Past this guy. He's the quickest way back to the... the exit, I think. Or jump in the water. Where is this guy? I heard a footstep on tile a second ago. Okay, he's just come downstairs again. Signal to move. All right. Oh, there's a ladder there too. Okay, so you can get out of the water in this room. Good to know. So is that? That's four talismans, right? Maybe not the right fire one, but if it's the wrong fire one, we can come and try again. find out right away what's the fire one okay it's still vanished but it opened the five doors so it is correct is that wrong earth was wrong Damn 
it, guys. This is a shitty mission. Well, it's a shitty puzzle design. And the context of if you get it wrong, you gotta go drapes all the way back. Ah, I don't have patience for it. Um, So, what am I going to do? Which ones do we, do we not, if we get wrong? We got Earth and Air wrong. Wait, I definitely took the right one, the one, the next one in the sequence for Air, didn't I? I don't. I'm extremely tempted to control shift alt N right now. Because I don't want to go back and do all that again and run around all there and find maybe the right one, maybe the wrong one. But fire was one of the ones we got wrong, right? Earth was correct. Water was correct. Well, I don't have the patience for it. Um, so, what I've done, I'm now running a Dromid, and have, um, which means the AI is turned off, well, their ability to detect me is turned off. So what do I need? I still need air and earth. Air is a little spinny thing. Earth is a little carrot thing. Since I'm in Dromid, I increase my walk speed too. I don't even remember where any of the. Because uh, it's not like any of the rooms were themed, right? I don't even remember where the things were supposed to be found. Which one's this? This is Earth. So what it said, it said Earth to seed to tree to animal, right? Well, I took that one. That's, oh, that's the one that's shown. Wait, was this the one I tried last time? I think so. We'll see if it's right or wrong. This is not too far. One thing about changing your run speed is you can set up really, really ridiculously high. So high that you hurt yourself by running. <laughs> As your body collides with itself. Okay, that is the wrong one. Despite that's what the book seemed to suggest I should be going for, but maybe I'm misinterpreting the things because I don't have pictures. And Garrett's forgotten all his keeper training, so he doesn't remember what that seed and tree and animal things look like and his interpretation of them were clearly wrong. You know, I thought earth, seed, tree, animal. I mean, this one's got, looks like a dog's footprint or a cat's footprint, ball print. I guess we just trial and error on this one. Wrong. Wait, I think that means I tried all of them. Didn't I try the earth, earthy earth one first? I don't know. We'll find out. Hey, dude. Oh, he actually rose all the way through there.
Okay. That does not line up with what I've read and what the hints told me I should be doing, but never mind. For so air, where was the air one? Through here, wasn't it? So I thought we wanted that one. Maybe we want that one. I guess just trial and error until it works. All right. Well, let's run at normal speed then. Guess this is the way out. Well, you know what I'm gonna do. Let's save here. Okay, so now I'm back in thief proper, rather than drum it. Just in case there's more to this level, I'll be playing it properly. Oh, no, nope, that was the end of the mission. Pickpocketed all of them. We didn't figure out the puzzle because it was obscure and ended up just being trial and error even when we'd been told how the puzzle worked, which is, I have to applaud a puzzle of that design for obtuseness. Um, you know, I guess that's typical of the keepers. They like, they like to be really obtuse, so very, very keeper-esque. Not very fun to play. Clever idea. If I hadn't been playing on the expert and could have knocked some of the guys out, I would have probably been okay with it. But the fact I couldn't even knock them out was um, just made it frustrating. All right. However, the balance has been restored. Frustration is seeping away. Calmness will reign. Uh, that has been Equilibrium. So thanks for watching. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it more than I did. Uh, I'll see you here for the next mission.